And the first day of school is less than three weeks away for some schools. Many districts are doing what they can to eliminate the so-called digital divide. CBS 47's Kaylee Hunt spoke with Fresno Unified on how they plan to provide quality education online. Right now, educators across the state are trying to think through all the scenarios that we need to address. State Superintendent Tony Thurman has been very vocal about stopping the digital divide and has outlined his findings with his task force. To say, how can we fill gaps? We still have a lot of work to do, but we know that addressing those three pillars is going to be important. Safety first, social emotional learning, needs of our students, and the continuity of learning. Fresno Unified has been on the forefront with providing tablets, laptops, and other electronic devices. Kurt Madden with Fresno Unified says he feels confident no student has been forgotten. As school starts online, we anticipate another probably five to 10,000 more students because we've been providing them for the last five months to any student that wanted a device. Madden says they have plenty of electronics for those students still needing devices. Another topic Thurman has been pushing is adjusting the current ethnic studies curriculum to include more teachings of Chicano, African American, and Indigenous studies. We have African American studies and uh, we have Chicano studies as well, um, but we'd like to um, grow um, in making sure that all of our secondary schools have them because all of our secondary schools at this point don't have them. Castillo says not all of their high schools offer ethnic studies, which is something he wants to change. Castillo believes when students are taking classes they are interested in, they'll stay engaged whether that course is offered in person or online. Fresno Unified urges any parent who does not have a laptop or a tablet for their student or access to the internet to contact them immediately before the start of the school year, which is August 17th. For now reporting in Fresno, I'm Keely Hunt, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.